क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोस फ्रॉम ईकीडा हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन द प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी हैव डिस्कस अबाउट द नेचुरल रबर एंड नाउ इन दिस टॉपिक वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द वल्कनाइजेशन ऑफ रबर सो व्हाट डज दिस वल्कनाइजेशन मींस लेट मी टॉक अबाउट दैट इन दिस टॉपिक So friends now in this topic we are going to talk about vulcanization so what does vulcanization means vulcanization is nothing but it is mixing of sulfur with an appropriate amount and also with the appropriate temperature that is between 100 degrees celsius to 150 degrees celsius so this kind of mixing of sulfur at a particular temperature it will make the rubber harder so this is a process to make a rubber harder so therefore this process is known as vulcanization and this vulcanization process is was discovered by charles goodyear and now let me talk about what are the advantages of adding sulfur in natural rubber so it has been found that is suppose if 1 to 3% of sulfur is basically added in a rubber at during the vulcanization process that rubber can be used in rubber bands talk about the other advantage that is 3 to 10% of sulfur when ever added in a rubber and that kind of rubber that is after vulcanization it is used in tires and talk about the next one that is it has been found that is 10 to 20% or we could say like 10 to 30% of sulfur if it is added in a rubber that is during the vulcanization process that will make the rubber very much harder so therefore this addition of sulfur it helps to link the two linear polymers which are of rubber and that by making the rubber very much elastic and it will be very much helpful that is if we apply force on it so therefore the rubber will not tear so that is the reason that vulcanization is very much important so thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have understood that is what is vulcanization and i hope i'll see you next time till then don't forget to subscribe ek channel thank you so much